so much, Simone. It's 918. Let's talk about your first alert forecast and what's next for a lot of folks. It's cleanup uh, and the good news if that applies to you is we've got a dry day ahead in Phoenix. Now it's humid out there, so it doesn't feel dry, but meaning no new rain on the way. We do have a chance for mountain thunderstorms today, especially in parts of eastern Arizona, and we'll show you what the models are showing for that here coming up. But we've got changes on the way as we head into the weekend, a weather pattern change, and it is thanks to a low pressure system dropping down the coast of the Pacific Northwest and what that does for Arizona. It puts us back under the influence of a dry westerly flow. This is the drier air here in orangish red, but you can see even that dark gray. That's drier air cutting into our monsoon moisture, and it's why in western Arizona today, our chances for storms just are not there. Chance for storms mainly in spots here highlighted in green. If it's an area here highlighted in darker green, that's the SPC or the Storm Prediction Center's convective outlook. They've put you in a marginal risk, a slightly higher risk today for severe weather. So heavy rain, strong downburst winds, a threat today along the northern Arizona border and in southeastern Arizona, southern portions of Gila County included in that as well. It's quiet right now. Our radar showing just some storms in the far southeast corner of the state going forward in time. Our models are showing that will be a very active part of the state today, especially after lunchtime today. The storms get going. They start, they move almost to the north and northeast. So for the Valley Metro area, we're going to watch for these storms that develop in this area, but I don't think there's a huge chance of any of that coming close enough to the valley to bring us rain. What we could get are some gusty outflow winds or maybe some blowing dust. Uh, not out of the question, especially as we head into the evening hours, but then things pretty much settle down as we head into the overnight hours. Highs today across the state. Uh, down just a little bit from yesterday. 106 in Bullhead City and Lake Havasu. 107 for Yuma and Gila Bend. 75 for Flagstaff and 85 for Pace and 93 for Globe. 104 today for Casa Grande and 108 for the Valley. We're pushing into the 90s right now. 91 degrees with a 65 degree dew point. So it's still feeling sticky out there. Thanks to all that moisture left from yesterday's rain. No new rain through the weekend though. Again, we're drying it out around here. Next chance of rain could be by the middle of next week. We'll keep you updated as we get closer. Thank you.